hey y'all welcome back to my channel um i want to first start off by saying i apologize if you hit a fan yo but um i just finished filming the um brats challenge look for um this uh makeup so i turned the fan on just because i had got hot for a second but then it's a contradiction because i'm hot but i got on a roll y'all don't judge me i'm anemic don't judge my life but um i'm here to bring you guys a massive makeup haul i have um a makeup haul from a palette that i got for christmas from my aunt some makeup that i got from ulta cvs target and the crayon case so let's get started i want to start off with what my um auntie got me for um christmas Cause she knows that I love makeup. She knows I do all the little makeup stuff. So she did um, get me the Morphe and the collab that James Charles did with Morph um, for the um, James Charles makeup palette. So this is that. I have that. I haven't touched it um, just yet, you guys. Um, that's why the film cover is still on. I haven't touched it at all. Um, just yet. I haven't even swatched it, y'all. To be completely honest, it was um, still in the box and in the bubble wrap. I just, you know, kind of took it out <laughs> just to show it in this video because I'm, I'm real particular about stuff like that. If I'm not using it right there and in there, I'm going to keep it in the packaging. And I do keep a lot of the boxes from my makeup, y'all. And y'all, I'm sorry if I'm not as animated and not as loud right now. It's just because I'm kind of tired, but this makeup looks popping, y'all. I really thought that I was um, Sasha, the Brat Star Sasha. I really thought that I was her. Um, So I got that um, from my aunt for Christmas. Now let's see which one do I want to go to next. I'll do Ulta next. So, um, from Ulta, I got the Juvia's Place, The Warriors by Juvia Palette. I have a, um, no, this is the Amazon. The Amazon. I think I'm doing it right. This is my first Juvia's Palette, um, palette. I haven't opened this up either, y'all. It's still in the, um, still in the bubble wrap plastic because I did swatch it at the store and I really like the colors just a you know real matter of fact let me open it and show it to you guys because I feel like this is a neutral everyday natural palette this is how it looks really really cute I'm melanin sisters uh oh I don't want, I don't want the plastic film to come off but this is how the inside of the palette looks really nice neutral everyday colors in my opinion you could do a simple everyday kind of eye with this palette i promise you you can so um i'm gonna put it back in the bubble wrap y'all and back in the box um i really don't pop them out of the palette until pop them out of the box until i use them i actually just threw away the um packaging for my box of crayons um palette um i got these brushes i got the elf Pointed foundation brush and the e.l.f. blending brush. Y'all, anytime I see brushes, I grab them up. I got this Duo Quick Set Strip Lash Adhesive. Just because I'm tired of having to wait for my um lash glue to dry and get tacky. So I can put it on my eye. But, um, and I got this in the color black. Yeah, this is, well, dark tone. I got it in the color dark tone. I got some Real Technique brushes because that was on sale. Um, I got the Real Techniques Eye Shade and Blend um, brushes. I got the Setting um, brush. And then I got the Expert Concealer brush. Again, y'all, I'm going to say, anytime I see some brushes, I'm going to grab them up. Especially if they're on sale, honey. Train. They're on sale. I'm going to grab them up. Um, I got these two concealers by Essence. They're the Camouflage Matte Concealer. And I got this one in the shade 
golden toffee and light ivory and y'all these are just they're really light and so i know y'all see all this melanin in my skin so y'all probably like girl what but i really got these just to use as um on my eyes to cut my crease simply because um i want to get more into cut creases now this is a semi-cut crease i don't i'm gonna call it a semi-cut crease because i'm not gonna say it's a full cut crease but y'all these i want to use these to um do my cut creases with and then um while i was down at the essence um by the essence station i saw these um brushes and this is the precise eyeliner brush by essence this is the eyebrow brush by Essence. And then an eye blender brush by Essence. And again, whenever you see brushes, y'all, snatch them up. And I also got this NYX Butter Gloss. I had this Butter Gloss a long time ago, but I do not know what happened to it. I don't know if I threw it away or if I lost it or if somebody stole it. I'm gonna go with somebody stole it from me. But um, this is the NYX Butter Gloss in the color Praline. And if you are a melanin infused sister like myself, y'all, this is a perfect kind of glossy nude. Glossy everyday nude. I'm gonna say everyday nude. Um, is this NYX Butter Gloss and Praline. Love it. I really don't know what happened to my last one, y'all. I really think somebody got me. Somebody stole it. Somebody stole it. That's what I'm going to go with. So next, I'm going to do CVS. Because I only got two things from CVS, y'all. Only two things. From, well, I got more than two things when I went to CVS. But two makeup-related items from CVS. I got the NYX Butter Gloss um, Lip Kit. This was at the checkout counter, and they, I think they did that on purpose. Y'all put that on purpose for people like me who don't know how to say no. So, these are in the color. It's three of them. And at first, I thought, oh, those are just going to be travel size. But they're actually full-size lippies. And I got this one in, well, they come in a pack. This one is in Fortune Cookie. This one is in Madeline. And then this one is in creme brulee. And they're all just, you know, like nudes, peachy nudes. I can't stay away from the nude glosses. Y'all know I love me a good nude gloss. And if you don't know, now you know. Um, and I also needed some makeup wipes. So I got the, um, this is the CVS brand of the makeup remover wipes. But they're comparable to the Neutrogena. Uh, makeup removal wipes. They didn't have the um, Neutrogena ones in stock, so I got this option. Cheaper. We gonna roll with it. Hope it don't break my face out, but we gonna roll with it. We gonna roll with it. We gonna roll with it. Okay. So next is going to be my Target run. And y'all, I went into Target. Um to purchase TMI, but to purchase some organic pads because, you know, they're supposed to be better for you, um, better for the environment, better for the earth, and better for your JJ. So I, I went in there to get those. Y'all, I saw the yellow sticker, and if you are a frequent Target shopper, you know about the yellow sticker. That yellow sticker just stops you dead in your tracks. And that yellow sticker stopped me dead in my tracks because it was like the entire makeup section was on sale so i got these and i still have the um price sticker on them i got these sonia kashuk never know if i'm saying her name right feathered lash trio and these kind of look like some wispy lashes and it's three of them and they were 388 for all three of these so I thought that was a good deal. I got, um, I don't even think these are the same thing. A Revlon Color Stay 24 hour um, matte finish foundation for combo and oily skin. Are these the same? Let me see. They are just different packaging. 
um no my they're the same just different packaging but um it has spf 15 in it and i got the shade mocha and y'all i got the shade toast now toast i honestly don't know why i got toast y'all <laughs> but they were two dollars and 88 cents and i got toast and mocha no i know why i got toast because i was like maybe if mocha i'm not sure if y'all could tell but if mocha is too dark for me i can mix a little bit of toast in there kind of you know so that's why now i remember why i got this one now it's coming back to me and they were two dollars and 98 cent a piece and they're originally ten dollars so that's a good that's a good deal y'all that's a good deal I'm gonna pass that one up um i got a sonia kashuk brush and this brush is the what brush is this the tapered blending brush and i love that they come in these so i know that ain't nobody been touching it but y'all it's a tapered blending brush like it and then like the the bottom is slanted it's really cute feels really sturdy feels really heavy and nice in the hand i got two of their l'oreal infallible lasting matte finish powders in cocoa because it was three dollars oh that brush this brush was six dollars and fifty cents and these L'Oreal Infallible Powders were $3.28. And I got the last two that they had because y'all ain't nothing like getting, especially for our skin tone, getting, you know, powders for this good of a price. So, you know, I took the last two. And what you gonna do about it? Nothing. Um, Let's see. I also got these... Lord, let me see. They put the sticker right over. The L'Oreal True Match Lumi Glow Amore Glow Boosting Drops in the color Golden Hour. Yeah, this is in the well in the shade Golden Hour. And y'all, this is like a liquid highlight um situation. And it was three dollars and fifty eight cents. And I'm not gonna. I don't usually use liquid highlight because I use um. A liquid highlighter before i'm not gonna say the brand and maybe it was just the brand but i used a liquid highlighter before on my face and i didn't like it and now that liquid highlighter is just used in the this area um I'm, I'm, i forgot the word that they use for this area but you know this area to kind of like when i'm wearing that low cut stuff to you know make a little glisten or i put it on my legs but it don't go on my face no more i don't use that on my face but um i got this in the shade golden hour and this is going to be going over my body it's going to go all over my body it's not going to go on my face y'all um and then i got two of these nyx glitter goals liquid eyeshadows what shade is this one i got this one in multiverse and it's like a like a bronzy glitter i'm not sure if y'all can see that and then I got this one in the shade Imaginarium. And this is like a gunmetal. Ooh, but it looks like it got like purple reflect and stuff in it. But it's like a gunmetal, y'all. Y'all see it real nice, real pretty. So that is my the items that I got from Tajay. You know, when you feel fancy, you go to Tajay. Okay, so I did Tari, I did CBS, I did Ulta, I did. So now you're the makeup from the crayon case. Y'all, you know, um, when Super was having that big sale, I got some stuff before she had the sale, but um, I did get some stuff during her, um, the sale that she had around Christmas time christmas new year christmas and new year's one of those um times i did um purchase but i purchased twice so okay i just let's just cut all that i just made a purchase from the crayon case two times got some stuff from her um i got the matte book i got the matte book y'all and if y'all are not sure how the matte book palette looks 
this is how it looks i haven't used it yet still got plastic on it and it was still in the box that it came in but i took it out the box and this is how that palette looks just in case you guys have not seen the inside of that palette that is how the um inside of that palette looks and then the rest of the items well i got a crayon um a crayon case pouch and i put the rest of the items in here because i didn't realize that this crayon case pouch was going to be so big and i really like that it's this big because i really thought it was going to be one of those drop in the bag type of um purses but um type of pouches but i'm so happy that it's this big because when i'm traveling you know to my boots house <laughs> doing my overnight stay i can pack my makeup in here that i want to wear so i got a um on a roll highlighter y'all and yes i have used this i have used this bad boy you guys i have i have used it and if you aren't sure y'all i just got my nails done today and I don't want to break them. Oh, yeah. Shut up to Ben. Uh, he gets me right every time. Y'all, I don't want to mess my nails up. But, y'all. Yeah, okay, it popped open. I ain't mess my nails up. But this is how it looks. Yes, y'all, I put this on. I actually, I think I used this during my date night. Yeah. When I did a date night, I did use this. Love it. But I mean, I'm impressed by all of her products, so. Ooh. I knew that I was going to be impressed by that one. I just wanted to make sure that I got mine so that I could be on the honor road, too. I got a chalk dust setting powder in the shade in. Still in the box, y'all. Still in the box. I haven't used this one just yet. But this is it in the shade in. Shade in. And y'all don't make fun of me for keeping all my stuff in the box. But I just want to make sure it don't get messed up. And then y'all know I got the Anglo, the Anglola highlighter powder. I got that a while back probably summer 2019 when she had the big um the big containers of it um on sale as um along with the judy brush i got the judy brush and i got that um big anglola um but these are her other highlighters that she has so now i have all of her loose highlighters um i have that i got the gloating that's the packaging and this is how that one looks I got Rosy Glorez. That's how that looks. And I got Glocane. And that's how that looks. So I'm excited about using those, you guys. Um, and then I also, as y'all know, over the either over the well y'all probably don't know because i don't know if i did an upload if i um did a haul video for that but over the summer i got two of her um hall pass lip gloss collections i got the clean kisses and private party because i see her wearing clean kisses all the time and i'm like yes that's the perfect nude again i'm into nudes so i wanted it i got it but um i finished up and got pecan popping and I feel like this is going to be a nice everyday nudie too. Got pecan popping. And I also got soft twerk. Let me pop this thing over. And this is, this is soft twerk. Okay. So I have all of the Hall Pass lip gloss collections now. Yeah, y'all. Um, and then the rest of the items in here are the liquid lipsticks, y'all. I'm talking about. I now have all of her liquid lipsticks. I'm missing 
my liquid lipstick in the color Raven. I don't know where the thing went. Um, I haven't repurchased just yet because I know I'm going to find it somewhere. I know it's probably either in my room or in my car. But I got the liquid lipsticks. I got the rest of the liquid lipsticks. And I'm going to go off one by one with these liquid lipsticks. I got the color Jambalaya. Jambalaya. I'm not gonna take these out of packaging, y'all, because that's gonna take too long with these nails. Got Blackboard, which is basically a black lipstick. Yes. I got Pablo, which is the yellow. I got Marie. You can't really see it, but I got Marie, which is a light nude color. I got Murder Matte. Wore this on my date. Let's just say that lipstick can come off all night long, y'all. I was eating, I was drinking, lipstick didn't come off at all. Murder Matte Gumbo, which is what I have on now. Love it. Presidential. Hey, hey, presidential. Y'all, I miss Barack. Presidential. Lucci, a green. I can't wait to do a look for St. Patrick's Day with this, y'all. When I say in my office, they're not going to be able to tell me nothing because I'm going to come up in there with green lipstick on, period. Hell City. Hell City is like a, um, it's a, it's a new, it's a new too. I know that I'm going to have to mix this with another color just because of my skin tone. But again, I said I wanted to support, you know, Super because I've been following her since the Vine days and I wanted to buy everything. So I got Holly Grove, which is that pink color. Holly Grove. And then I got the infamous Crawfish. I'm so happy that Crawfish was back in, um, stock. So y'all know I had to scoop it up just before everybody took their antennas to the website and bought it up again. But, um, is that everything that I got? I do believe that's everything that I got, you guys. Again, um, this is a bigger thing. I think, I'm no, this isn't the biggest haul, makeup haul that I've done on my channel. Because I think the uh, makeup... The MUA Beginner's Kit is the biggest haul that I did, but this is a, the biggest haul that I've done of makeup for myself. Um, if y'all want to know, no, I am not an MUA. I um, gave that dream up a long time ago. <laughs> I'm going to just be honest, I gave that dream up a long time ago. But um, yeah, this is the haul. Again, y'all, look at my nails. I don't mind my hands being ashy because when I do my makeup, I wash my hands beforehand and I don't put no, you know, lotion or nothing on because I don't want to mess up my face, make up, mess up my makeup. So don't mind ash. Just check out the bling. Check out the bling, y'all. And y'all, my pinky on this hand messed up, so don't even worry about that. Matter of fact, let's just do it like this. Y'all, I showed Ben a picture of what I wanted and he did better than the picture y'all and of course you know, i had to get up my pinky as a stiletto because the pimp hand be strong it be strong all right y'all on your plan but i'm about to go wash my face get in the shower and your girl about to go to sleep i'm about to knock out i'm about to crash like a crash dummy you understand me so make sure that you like comment and subscribe to my channel so make sure you tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend to come watch me because i'm gonna get better with uploading my videos and every video that i make i'm gonna say that so that i make sure i hold myself accountable and i want y'all to make sure y'all hold me accountable as well go to my social media sites and be like um excuse me where's the video you said that you was gonna be better with these uploads. You was gonna get us some videos out here on some on time. So where you at? Huh? Huh? Oh, okay. Get to YouTube and upload them videos. But alright, y'all. Have a good day, night, whenever you're watching this video. Just have a good whatever. Go out there. Be great. Alright, y'all. Peace.